Hey, it's Aviva Goldfarb. Welcome to my kitchen. I am gonna show you an easy rice salad recipe. It's a mango, brown rice, and black bean salad. That is such a hit with everybody, kids and adults, even kids who normally don't like brown rice tend to really like the colors and flavors in the salad. You're gonna want two cups of cooked rice, one can of drained and rinsed black beans, one mango cut into small chunks, or you can even use frozen mango that you thaw and make sure it's cut into quarter to a half inch chunks, a quarter of a sweet yellow onion, such as Vidalia or Walla Walla, those kinds are better for eating raw, so about a half cup, and a quarter cup of scallions or chives. Use the green parts only. You can use the light and dark, finely chopped. Quarter cup fresh cilantro chopped. The juice of one lime and about a quarter teaspoon salt or a little more to taste if that doesn't taste quite salty enough for you. You're just gonna combine everything in a large serving bowl, toss it together and then if the rice was hot, you're gonna to wanna to chill it for at least 10 minutes or up to 24 hours. Our brown rice, mango, and black bean salad is all ready and it tastes even better than it looks and it was so easy to put together. This would be a great one to bring with you if your kids have sports in the afternoon and you know you're gonna to have to have some sort of healthy dinner on the road, you can pack this right up and everybody's gonna love it. Um, if you like this recipe, make sure and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment below. Let me know how you make the salad a little different with your own spin on it. And remember, you are never too busy to eat well. Let's see how it tastes. Mmm. I love those flavors. Everything's better with mango. I'm gonna show you how to cook a spaghetti squash without cutting it first. You can do it either in the microwave or in the oven or in the slow cooker. And then it's so easy to cut once it's soft and you can enjoy your beloved spaghetti squash. We're gonna enjoy it with basil and Parmesan and garlic and shallots today without worrying about cutting off a finger.